Yeah, it's a lovely morning here in the marina. There's a storm on the way tomorrow, apparently. Right, after the incident when the tripod flew up in the air, with the nice new Sony camera mounted to it, I've gone for this. Which is quite sturdy and quite discreet, so I'm going to see if the camera actually fits on it. Let's have a look. Okay. Assume the position. Yeah, I think that will work. And it will give us the opportunity to do some... Well, that's not right. Oh, some panning shots. Except it's not quite vertical, is it? It's not quite horizontal, it's not quite level. How would I know I've got my glasses on? We've got other cameras for that. Hmm. Now this camera, this is our action camera, the waterproof. And you, so is that one. But this one's easy to use, unlike the GoPro that I gave away because I think it was the most overpriced piece of um, well, I won't. shut up I won't describe what I thought of it but I gave the GoPro away and I bought this it was a fraction of the price and it's Olympus and what you do when you want to record something there's a big red knob there and you just press it unlike the menus and commands that you have to go through with the GoPro and when you want to stop recording you just press stop marvellous and it films in 4K don't get me wrong the, the, the footage from the GoPro was fantastic but it uses this proprietary software and very often you would plug it into your Mac and it would say what GoPro? Nah. Nothing, nothing on here. No GoPro on here. So you're stuck with your footage in the camera that you can't get off. This just plugs in via any USB port. Wham, bang. Anyway, what I bought is the, these fantastic things here. Look, they, they flop all over the place. But when you get it in the position you want, and you tighten that knob, everything becomes solid. So this one will probably, the canopy won't be up, but it will still be available. So when we're out cruising, that will mount onto the, and then you just turn the camera where, wherever you want it to point, and tighten the knob. How fantastic is that? We've got all this fantastic camera equipment. We've got two of those. This is going to go on the front. What I was going to say is, we've got all this fantastic camera equipment, but we don't make very interesting content. But I enjoy myself, and that's all that matters. Now this one is going to be mounted on the front, on a pole. And this can be controlled from the mobile phone, which will be here with me. So I should be able to have it mounted so it'll look as though it's floating in mid-air. There'll, there'll be no shots of the cratch or the bow of the boat. It's going to be mounted, suspended, and we'll take some really riveting, boring shots of the canal. So that's where that one's mounted. able to get a view from that and uh, I should be able to control it zoom on off 
from the steering position at the rear of the boat via a mobile phone app. Not my actual mobile phone because I'm always worried about that stays down below because I'm always worried about dropping it in the cut. But a dedicated spare mobile phone. I've, I've got to cut this down by the way, that's on me. That will be taken home and cut to size and mounted correctly. That's just a temporary measure. Right, this. Uh, it's a bit of a faff setting this up. So you set that up. Then you hold down the Wi Fi button. And then you get a QR code. Then you go to Easy Setup. Scan the QR code and it says connect. And it takes a lifetime. There we go. Oops, it's connected. Press on uh, remote control. Let's change the bit rate. Right, so that is now seen. What that sees. It's beautiful blue sky and clouds. So the idea is that sits on the front of the boat. That stays on the back. And you just hit the record button and hey presto. Where's your dead cat? My dead cat, my dead cat's here. Dead I think it's more of a dead hamster to be honest because it's not very big. It does the job. So, that's most of the cameras that we use. We've got some others at home that we don't bring up. By the way, we'd never leave these on the boat. They go everywhere with me. Even if we go out walking, they go with us. Alright, so that's the end of that one. There is one other toy we don't use that often to be honest um, but it's here there we go that's sparky which we have used a couple of times in our videos and we probably will it's more some of my point. toy really isn't it it's more Tom's toy I, I, I am a typical geriatric when I fly this thing. You're terrified, whereas I like to throw um, it around. Terrified. Yeah, I, I can throw it around, chuck it around. I took it sailing with me the other week, um, and I was filming over the lake with people sailing, and I couldn't see it, <laughs> and I completely panicked and threw, threw the remote control to somebody else and said, "Bring it back." But there you go. Well, that's Sparky. If um, if anyone's stuck with this video this far, mm. alert, warning, boop, 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 there's a, a little musical interlude it's coming rubbish. up next. <laughs> it's our audition for Britain's Got Talent. We've no. seen we've seen the winner this year. We've got to be we've got to be favourite. Oh, for God's sake! So don't feel obliged to watch. Didn't I want to say a few words to my friends. But you haven't got any. Antibiotics are wonderful pills, but don't think that they will cure all of your ills. 
I don't know what comes next. So every time you, you think you're under the weather? Every time you think you're under the weather. What was that one we did for Amazon, that advert? Oh, um, yeah. Yesterday, all my parcels were so far away. But, but now. But now with Amazon, you can get them today. Same day. Same day. Oh, I believe. Oh, I don't believe in yesterday. In Oh, I believe in Amazon, same day. Oh.